Fisher. Good morning and welcome to Sunday Morning Worship. I'm so glad that you're here. Today we're going to be singing songs, hearing prayers, and hearing from the Word of God. Stay tuned. It's going to be an awesome Sunday.
I'm Emily. And I'm Davis. And this is your Promised Land News. Where you can get all the latest news, weather, and sports. Today is the first Sunday of Lent. Lint? You have lint on your shirt. I've got a lint roller that will fix it. Davis, Davis, come back. It's not that kind of lint. It's Lent, which is the 40 days before Easter. What do we do in 40 days? Glad you asked. Emily, I know what I'm fasting. It is candy. And I'm fasting from dessert. Yeah, always remember y'all, it's better when you're here. And as the Bible tells us in 3 John chapter 1 in verse 4, I rejoice to see my children walk in the truth. Until next time, good morning, Emily. Good morning, Davis. Good, good morning, morning Promised Land. Land. The thing that you have on your clothes, those little balls? Yeah, that is. But we have a time during church what we call the Lent season. L-E-N-T. Lent is a time, it's 40 days that we recognize that starts on a Wednesday. And it's this Wednesday starting February 17th and it lasts till April the 3rd, right before Easter, which is April the 4th. Now we don't count on Sundays, but every other day of the week is during this time of Lent. Now, 40 days is significant because 40 days is the time where Jesus was tempted in the wilderness for 40 days. You want to count to that? 40, 40 days where he was tempted. And during that time, he was fasting, he was praying, and he was, and he was getting ready for his ministry. Now, fasting during the time of 40 days is when Jesus gave up eating and gave up food. For us, we may not have to do that, but we give up something that we enjoy. For you, it may be a toy, be uh, anything that you enjoy that you give up for 40 days. And then also, which is really important, we give up something, but we go to something. And going to something is, is that we spend time with God in praying, reading our Bible, helping other people, those types of things that draw us closer to God. Lenten is a time to where we have self-reflection, where we think about and all about our relationship with our wonderful Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Please join in Lent because it is a wonderful time for all of the church. Let us pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. So guys and girls, as we end our time here in our Promised Land worship, uh, let's do our prayer as you go back out into the world. All right? Those like this. As you go on your way, May Jesus go with you, before you to show you the way, above you to watch over you, behind you to encourage you, within you to give you peace, and next to you to be your friend. Amen. Have a blessed week. All right. Woo!